Basically, when we get up to position, we'll be about 200 meters downwind of it. We'll talk to the release, enable it, and pop it. The location is orange. Uh, you see all the four yellow hats. Yeah, it'll come up close together. Probably one float, and then it should be maybe. It won't be that far away. top floats that we'll be going after first is a five meter polytron pennant that we'll try to grapple for. So the captain will bring down the vessel down the starboard side or the mooring down the starboard side. We'll throw the hook. Bring it toward the ship. This will be right up to the right to the hull. Tight. So I have a 12 foot uh, pickup pennant that will go be attached to a pickup hole. Reach down and snap it. We'll just walk. If we pick it up forward of the step a quarter, we'll just walk everything out. Usually I don't haul this up until everything's in line with the ship. The rest of the morning. So so everything's streamed out nice. Once we get the uh, the buoy in that five meter shot wire rope up near the uh, A frame, there we'll stop it off. Bring the A frame in. That, I don't know how heavy that these floats are, the orange ones, yeah, but those are yeah, so we can just pop those into the tires. And do our disconnect. And then I can transfer the TSE winch over to the rest of the morning. Normal operation from the A frame out, um, back in, disconnect a couple instruments of the glass balls, and um, generally that's it.
when we come up to a, an instrument or a section that we have to disconnect the instrument from, we'll just take a bite, stop it off, do a death cleat, do a disconnect of the instrument, and then reattach the uh, working line.